I am appalled. It strikes at the very heart of what a university should do with the properties and the historic legacy that form a part of the campus. The threat of tearing down the Case House is causing effects in the community. Director of Heritage Studies Clyde I'm, Milner I'm explains how he feels about the situation. <laughs> tearing it down makes ASU look bad and makes many people who love ASU angry, unhappy, and alienated. Retired ASU professor of history, Michael Dugan, believes this building has huge historical value. This is an inspirational site for the courage that created this institution. This is part of their heritage. This is part of their identity. This is who they are. Milner and Dugan encourage concerned citizens to take action. I urge people to pray for our administrators. For the quality of mercy is not strained, and it needs to fall on this house. We should make it a place that we honor and recognize and that we use effectively as a university. And so I call upon alumni and friends of the institution to save the Kays' home. Milner and Dugan want everyone to know that they are not against sorority houses. And there's no quarrel with building sorority houses, but there is a quarrel with saving this house on this spot. I'm not opposed to sorority houses. Sororities are important to our university. It's not sororities versus the Kays' house. Let's keep the Kays' house. Let's also build some beautiful sorority houses. It can be done. Milner and Dugan will do everything they can to save this building. I am not loath to drop this and say, oh, it's just another house. It's not. It's a symbol, and it's a symbol that deserves protection and recognition. I do not think that our university should make the absolutely tragic mistake of destroying a landmark home, the home of the founding president of Arkansas State, the man who is the reason we have a university today. Abigail Robinson, ASU-TV News.